Greetings to all the IHOP KC community here in Kansas City and to the extended spiritual family across the world. We have some sobering announcements to share with you. As of this morning, Stuart Greaves, executive director of IHOP KC, has resigned. He has also stepped down from the board of directors. Words cannot describe the impact this man has had in the IHOP KC community over the last 23 years. Thousands of people's lives have been impacted by his teaching, leadership, and love for Jesus. His time at IHOP KC included two decades serving as the head of the prayer room's night watch from midnight to 6 a.m., and for the past three years, he served as the executive director. The executive committee, led by General Kurt Fuller, who took over the management of this crisis on Sunday, December 10th, will be temporarily assuming the executive directorship responsibilities. Since taking over management of the crisis, the executive committee has received new information to now confirm a level of inappropriate behavior on the part of Mike Bickle that requires IHOP KC to immediately, formally, and permanently separate from him. People will surely wonder about details, but IHOP KC does not have permission from those individuals to share details while they are being vetted further by an independent investigator. The privacy of any person impacted by misconduct is tantamount. And this only amplifies IHOP KC's conviction that a complete investigation should be conducted into the allegations of clergy abuse by Mike Bickle. General Fuller will ensure that this gets done. Our current focus remains a thorough and complete investigation of the reported allegations, and we pledge to then implement any and all changes necessary to church policies, procedures, and culture to ensure that IHOP KC does not travel down this difficult road again. We have met and plan to continue to meet with the advocate group in an effort to establish trust and common ground. We ask the community to pray for this process. For some, these words will surely come as a shock and might cause deep pain, confusion, grief, or even sadness. Obviously, this is more than a routine church announcement. People's lives and families are being directly affected, and we understand that. We ask that everyone please be considerate and respectful to all the parties involved, especially on social media. There is a way out of these difficulties, but it starts with calming things down rather than ratcheting them up. Please remember, we hold steadfast to Jesus, to his leadership. He is our source and our great reward. The 24-7 prayer movement that God started will continue. IHOP KC will stand in the gap for Israel and ultimately continue to proclaim the beauty of Jesus until his glorious return.